Know that in this very moment, my heart is bursting with anticipation to see your beautiful, shining face waiting for me at the altar. I cannot stop tearing up as I write this to you. I keep thinking about the first time our eyes will lock and how we will be able to say so much in that moment without having to use any words. This is it, my love. I am ready. My heart is recklessly abandoned to you. My soul is rejoicing knowing we are about to become one for the rest of our lives. You two children of light, let love shine as you walk out this marriage brand and allow Christ to be your bright and morning star, your consuming fire, your day spring, light of the world, radiance of God's glory, refiner's fire, star out of Jacob, sun of righteousness, wall of fire, and your true guiding light. But there are a lot of people that have said, like, a lot of people have asked me, honestly, like, are you sad? Like, are you, do you have any type of sadness? Your best friend's getting married. For me, I've actually been able to answer that question with a solid, honest no. It has been one of the greatest joys of my life to know Andre, to be able to call him my friend, to be able to call him one of my best friends, and for him to be the other half to, to what's been my best friend for all these years. I just want to say that I couldn't be more happy for you guys, and I couldn't have picked anyone better for my best, my best friend. This marriage will not only survive, but it will flourish to influencing generations. So our toast is six words. The best is yet to come. I want you to say that with me. The best is yet to come. Now, take your toast and let's shout it to the heavens on three. One, two, three. The best is yet to come.